Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of the Battle for Astrakhazu. The Night Gods have secured the southern end of the airstrips. We're going to send the Dragon's Rejects north to take on the command and control centers. Alright, so here we are. Going to move up and see what we can take here. Wow. Look at this place. It's really, uh... There's a few areas up here. Looks like we need to, to uh, take over. So this is a three and a half skull blackout mission. So we're only allowed six, six units. Uh, so I decided to dial it down a little bit just to make it interesting. So rather than bringing the vulture, um, and what else do we leave behind? The vulture and uh, oh, that was it. That's right. I left the vulture behind. I gave the bushwhacker back to Taskmaster for now. Um, so she's running the the uh, the bushwhacker now. Uh, we got both trebs, and Moving I gave position. Skull back I'll the uh, the um, fire starter. Uh, let's put you here. Got it. LBX is up this way. Position confirmed. And let's get you into here. Mm -hmm. I'm going. So this could go one of two ways. It could be the turrets that are against us. Is there turrets? Nope. Could be nothing. Could be drop pods. Who knows? Let's, move. Let's just push straight in and take this. Understood. I'm not going to let... Uh, Acknowledged. I'm not going to let a few uh, clan units scare me off and here. Now. It's a three and a half skull against the clan, so... If anything, they'll get four or five, and I guess in a drop. Confirmed. Let's move up. Right, Commander. Roger. Uh. Turret's coming online. Okay. So I guess that's an okay thing. Let's get over here. Get a good commanding view of the turrets. I want you on this turret. Heading out. Infantry suppression. Calliope. Goss emplacement. That's got to go. Heavy shredder turret. That's got to go too. That's probably an AC-20. Um, let's get some speed up on you. Let's get over here. Alright. I think the AC-20 turret's got to go first. Then the Goss turret and then the rest. So this is infantry suppression, machine guns and flamers. Don't care too much about that. This guy runs really cool too, so even if they heat him up with flamers, it's not going to be that big of a deal. This guy here, AC-20's got to go. Uh, we'll hang on to the tandems. Okay, good damage. Yeah. Two LRM-10 Delta. So you are a single Gauss, Gauss rifle? You are. Let's get into here. Heading out. Get some good range on this turret. This ends up being a quick match. I got another one I can line up real quick after this. So, uh, yeah, let's go that route. <laughs> Not quite dead. What do you need? Do we want to use you on that turret or start on the Goss turret? Let's start on the Goss turret. Because we've got more than enough to kill that with other stuff here. So let's go out to the Goss turret. I'm going to uh, warlord this. Might as well front load it a bit. Okay, good hits. Ooh, popped it like a zit. Target destroyed. Goodbye. Ready for orders. We got two AC5s. What do we have left after this? We got the trebuchet with the MRMs. So let's get over here. Aye, aye. Let's go on this guy. Locking up. 
Couple hundred points damage, not bad. What can I do for you? Uh, how much do you have left? 134. I think we can get that with the uh, fire starter, no problem. Alright, let's go after this guy. You bet. Yeah, that guy's gone. Bang. You're dead. Yeah. Location confirmed. Not I mean if we even if we don't kill this turret, this fire starter could take the uh, could take the shot, I think. Let's make sure we get it though. I want to go with the tandems? Probably. Leave that off, though. Lock in touch. There we go. Nice. Woo! Like shooting fish in a barrel. SRMs are gone. Ooh. Damn it. I wounded. Did we get a head hit already? God damn it. Yep. All right, we're moving on to the second zone. Confirmed. We'll shoot the, t we'll just shoot the turret as we're like running away. Let's get some back shots on. I'm not gonna waste AC20 on ammo on it though. Yeah. All right, Sarge. Uh. Understood. Get a shot on it. It's at range, but you got the range, so let's do it. Leave you off. Fire the rest. Okay, good damage. Badass. Waiting on you, Commander. Okay. Got it. Max speed, no shooting. This should go quick. I can leave the MRAMs off. Time to die. We've got plenty of we got plenty to kill this guy. There's more where that came from. Is there? Yes, Commander. You got a bit of heat on you already, eh? Those flamers heated you up pretty well. Might as well get some retribution. Guess it doesn't matter which one we shoot here. Solid connection on that one. Ah, I was hoping they would bail out. Whatever. Okay. Leave those off. Lasers on. There we go. Show me your war face. Show War's me your war turret. face. I'm good at math. Waiting for orders. Good at math, are you? Aye aye. All right, let's get up here. Heading out. So, we've got to hurry up and kill the Reapers at this end of the valley. There are a lot of mercenaries dropping in now. And, uh, our home territory is, um... Uh, coming under fire and stuff, so... Gonna have to be very wary. The, uh, first static defense has moved back there. Looks like we got turrets up here. Coordinates received. And we've got our uh, vehicle unit too. On my way. Okay. We got turrets and probably mechs and buildings, it. most likely. Roger. Let's get out in the open. Location confirmed. Close to out in the open as possible. Location confirmed. Roger that. Alrighty, well. Got it. Uh huh. Let's move. Full speed Let's sounds ahead. good. On my way. Yep. Nah, we should be able to pop next turn, I think. We can actually get close enough. No sweat. Moving to position. Confirmed. You there. Coordinates received. Bring you up here. Confirmed. 
Not quite in range yet. They want us right in the base before they jump on us. Let's see if that counts. Understood. No need to tell me twice. Let's move. Uh, this is the okay. You go up there. Heading out. Let's get you up there with the ACs. I'm there. Fire starter down here. We close enough? Yep. Okay, so these guys are on our side. And we got a lance up there. Ooh, looks like it could be some good stuff. Maybe. What do we got? King crab, okay. A Mackie? Corsair? And <laughs> another Mackie! Really? We haven't seen a Mackie in like forever and all of a sudden we get two in one mission. We got a King Crab too. These guys are all old though. Two heavy rifles, Thunderbolt 10. This is supposed... It's like Clan Fire Mandrel. Why am I getting like... You could argue that these are like um, second line units, but these are like ancient. What do you need? All right, well, whatever. All right, get up here. Speed. Let's get on them. Orders. On it. Um, I think we try and get as many parts of the king crab as we can. I mean, we could get a Mackie. That might be interesting. To, uh, like, that would be the perfect mech to get for the uh, urban mech playthrough. And it would have been a relatively easy one because we just lay mines down here. What's this guy? Heavy laser carrier. Maybe we take that guy out first. That guy looks like he's probably pretty dangerous. <laughs> it's probably all medium lasers, but still. All right, we got one on. Looks like he's got lots of armor, too. Right here. Mm -hmm. Don't let that laser carry you. See ya. Get over there. Yep. Whoever comes down that uh, road, it's all yours. Yep. All right, Sal Jean. Going full throttle. Sal Jean. Got the ammo. Let's just drop it on him. That's war on it. Why not? Probably get one or two hits here. Three, five, six, six hits. Not bad. Standing in fire too. I hear you. Ooh, you can see somebody. Probably the Corsair. Yeah. We'll take a pot shot. Not gonna use the Warlord. It's no point. If I had multiple weapons, maybe, but. Stand still while I'm attacking you. Uh, he is. Good to go. He is standing perfectly still. All right, fire at this guy. Yeah, what a weird drop. That's a really weird drop. Oh, those are large chem lasers. A whole lot of them. Look at this thing. Wish I had a better gyro now. Losing lots of armor. I see that. These guys may be old, but we can't be messing around with them. Goes one of the buildings. Jesus. This should be fun. Alright. Well at least we got some turrets that can shoot back. King Crab's overheating already. We're gonna we're gonna bake him. Nice hits. Ooh, we got artillery on our side. We can probably knock the Mackie over. We can bake the uh We can bake the king crab, knock the Mackie over. Uh, let's vigilance this. 
Ah, the AC-20 is out of range, eh? That would still probably be enough to knock him over, though. AC-20 is in range for the King Crab, though. Let's get on this guy. Roger. Okay, add a little heat. Put him over. Ready for order. Somebody doesn't have a double heat sink yet. Oh, we put the ACs on the uh, Mackie, I think. Put the LBXs on the Mackie. Let's warlord this. Might as well throw the tandem rockets on. It might be just enough to put him over. Okay, two hits. That should put him down on the ground. Have a seat, buddy. Shit, I was really hoping we could see that laser carrier. Oh, oh. That's garbage chance to hit, though. Ah, <sighs> we gotta kill that laser carrier. I can't let him shoot. I think we have to go after him. We take the chance here with all of our tandems. Let's go with this. Put the barrage up too. We'll just launch everything at him. Hope we get lucky. Ah, the tandem rockets aren't too bad. You might be able to get enough penetration on this guy. He's got 40 internal structure though. Let's see what we can get. Okay, the laser's hit. Barrage is there. Alright, a lot of penetration, but no kill. That there was a critical hit, that was. It was. All out of short range missiles. Okay, we can't see the laser carrier from there. Where can we see him from? Right here. Let's get in here and close on him a bit. And let's warlord it. Let's hope we get the kill off this. Still got a fair bit of armor left, but we'll see. Affirmative. Looks like a side hit. Let's hit him hard. Nope, we gotta spend somebody else on him. Another hit like that, and you're toast. Yes, Commander. Yeah. I want Standing Sarge back. for the King Crab. Get you in here. Moving out. We're gonna go after the vehicle. Got the weapons, got the range, got the skill. Oh, yeah. That should do it. Yep. Nice. That could have been potentially bad. What do you need? Large chem lasers are no joke, man. They're just like a large laser. Confirmed. Right? 40 damage per pop, and that was a hell of a lot of them. Alright. Incendiaries on this guy, Ultra 5. And firing. Copy that. Enjoy the heat, buddy. Standing in fire. Corsair's overheating too, eh? Ooh, is he gonna shut down? Yep. Fuck, that's two buildings down. Wow, we get that guy. Hopefully he's got a bad chance to hit. Look at this thing. It looks like a friggin' uh, like a, uh, astronaut suit. Okay. Artillery's not firing, huh? Standing by. Move a little closer, get a side shot. Now, who do we want to go after? The Mackie, I guess. One of them. Whoever we got a better shot against. Oh, the AC-20's jammed. Because, of course, it's jammed. 25% on this guy. 63 on this guy. 
We might as well shoot after the king crab though. Let's go for his leg. He shut down too, but we'll keep applying heat to him. Okay, good damage. Got past the armor. You did. Commander. All right, our rockets are gone. Let's get into here. If we can put the king crab on his ass. Let's go after the leg. If we can put him on his ass, then uh, at least we know he's probably not going to hit much. Yeah, that should do it. There it goes. Have a seat, buddy. Oh. Have a seat. Okay, now. Yep. Why is the chance so bad on this guy? A little better. Probably Bad that. sensors, or maybe because the, I don't know. Maybe it's because the fire's in the way. Don't know. We go damage, or do we go incendiary? I don't think the incendiary is going to matter. He's going to keep shooting anyway. So let's go damage. Hopefully, get some instability on him. Okay, both of those hit. Receiving you. Same idea. Let's just keep shooting this guy. Okay, unstable. What can I do for you? Same idea. Let's just keep shooting that guy. Hopefully, put his ass. Well, we're not gonna put his ass on the ground, but oh yeah, I forgot they've got lower armor because of the. Uh, oh, there he goes. And stay down. See ya. Because they're old chassis, right? The armor is like 50% of what it should be or something. Fuck, that guy's got a rack. Oh shit, we could seriously lose this. We could seriously lose this in a second. Order. Okay, full speed it is. Okay, now have you gone yet? No, you have not. How do we kill three mechs in one turn? Okay, he switched targets. That's actually really good. That Corsair is overheating. Ooh, cross shot. Turrets on jam. Artillery strike coming in. All right, a little bit of damage. Warm him up a bit. He didn't even get up. Beautiful. So. Let's go after this guy, since we have such a great chance to hit. Hopefully we don't jam. Scored a critical hit. King Crab bailed. He had enough. Waiting for orders. All right. Um, we gotta choose our targets now. Going after this guy with the heavy ACs. Hope for the knockdown. Don't think we'll get it, but there it goes to the side. There's the knockdown. Right here. Okay. Let's get up on that guy. Tandems. That's all we have in this thing, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah, hopefully we get the tag on, but we'll fire everything. Oh, the heavy rotary's down this turn. So that's good for us. Waiting on you, Commander.
Do we move? I think we just shoot him. It's gonna give us our best chance to hit. We'll land with the most amount of weapons. No sweat. Missile barge. Ah! What's up, boss? Okay, did you lose a leg? You did not. We could core this guy, though. Or... I think we straight up fire suppress this guy. Well, he's got two medium lasers right now. This guy's only got an AC-5. Let's go after this guy. Okay, he's unstable. That hit something good. Is that the smoker? Reporting light damage. Okay, his rotary's unjammed, which means need? he's gotta die this turn. He dropped some heat, but let's just heat him back up again. I think I gotta move in here. See if we can get the mediums on him as well. Get into there. There we go. Uh, Warlord. <coughs> Excuse me. And, uh, yep. We had claws and everything, eh? Scored a critical hit. Well. Panicking. I think we should be okay here. Look at this thing. Shooting a turret. Nice. Aye, aye. Gonna Roger. go here. He goes on 9. You went on 15. Alright, so we're gonna go after this guy. Gonna switch it up a little bit here. See if you can shut his ass down. Aye, aye. Got past the armor. Only 21 heat, though. Commander. He's got no torsos. He's pretty much a stick. Roger. Well, now he's a stick. Beautiful. Yeah. Well, that was interesting. It could have been really, really bad. If they stayed on target and went after the buildings, there is a small chance they could have pulled that off. Hauling ass. If that guy's rotary hadn't jammed, we would have lost that match. Alright, let's go offensive push. Go up in the leg. Actually, let's go this route. Was it too much? I got the leg. Got the leg. Receiving you. School calling again, by the way. That's what the phone was. Yeah, let's get the best chance we can. Yeah, fuck. Oh well. Target eliminated. I mean, I don't really want a Mac. He's my first hundred ton Mac anyway. But. <laughs> Mission successful. I'm tempted to take parts of that heavy carrier. Tempted. And the reason why I say that is because we can use other like heavy carrier parts to put this together and that's armor's not too too bad 10 times large cam lasers we wouldn't be able to put any of these together anyway heavy rice look at all the large cam lasers here minus one accuracy but there's 10 of them so like laser vomit to hell 
Pulse Laser Raker. Heat 18. 30 damage straight up. It's not too bad. The Smoker. Salvo 20 Unguided Rockets. Area effect damage. All right. Uh, Thunderbolt 10. Actually, let's go down to the bottom. TBM 10 ammo. One. Six shots. Well, we're taking it. Because we need Thunderbolt ammo. Like, really badly. Because we want to get those TBM 30s rolling. And it uses TBM 10 ammo. So, so we'll take that. Um, wow. Uh, let's take that. And the two king crab parts. Let's go that route. Alright, Corsair part, heavy carrier part. AC 20. Um, uh, I think we can, we got two of those, we can just ditch that one. AC 5. We got two, we can ditch that one. We'll hang on to the raker, we'll hang on to the smoker. SRM 6 can go. Vehicle Flamer, I think, can go as well. Two 300 cores. That's not bad. We'll keep both of those. Lose the fuel cell. You lose you. Lose that. Lose that. SRM Tandem Ammo. We've got two, so we can ditch that. And we'll keep the Thunderbolt Ammo, obviously. So, I mean, at least we got Thunderbolt Ammo. Alright, so while our main unit is away, um, the, uh, the rest of the um, Dragon's Rejects have uh, set up a base here. What are those? We got some supplies coming in. And uh, all of a sudden we got attacked by uh, Reaper forces. So we basically just have whatever we've got here left over in our... Uh, looks like we got two mechs to help us out too. Two support mechs. Alright, so uh, yeah, so we got the Helopolis. We've got um, Copy. the Vulture. We've got the Panther that we had, that we just picked up. Uh, we've got the, where are you here? I'm here. The Nidhogg and the um, uh, Hetzer. So this is a two skull base defense. I just thought we'd just throw in what we had left over. We have two good pilots. Everybody else is mediocre and Fox is like the worst. We just hired her, so I threw her in the head, so hopefully she survives this. Uh, Bomber's wow. actually, you know, you know, moderate. She's got the HVAC 20 on the uh, Nidhogg, so hopefully she'll survive this. Uh, she probably will. Three. We got Rusty yeah. into the um, the Vulture. Uh, the, she's only got Gunnery 9, but she's got 10 because the Vulture gives her plus 1. Uh, flat lines in the Helopolis. And Why Cooler, uh, one of our secondary pilots that we just picked up, is uh, running the, the PPC SRM4 Panther with no upgrades. So we got to be careful he doesn't have full armor. All right, now we just got to figure out where the hell the enemy is. I don't know where they're attacking from, so let's get up here. Moving out. Enemy contact where? Oh, on this side. Swordsman, Urban Mech, Javelin, Centurion. Yeah, we shouldn't experience too heavy an attack, but you never know. Like, with these base defense missions, sometimes you end up with, like, really awful, uh, um, like, awful as in, we're going to kill you, awful uh, units. Okay, let's go. So, it's just a matter of. Uh, aye, aye. Luck of the draw, I guess. But who knows what the reinforcement's going to be. We're going to at least have two more lances coming in, so... we got a Sentinel. What else with us? A Whitworth. Okay. We'll just say that these were some of the mechs that we put together from our parts. Because I do have a list of a lot of the mechs that we picked up before we actually came into the valley. Anything that was um, we were capable of removing and repairing. I've kind of got a list of that. So those are what our allies are going to be piloting. So we'll just see these guys are our allies. All right, we can't shoot anybody else. We're just going to shoot this guy directly. What's up, buddy? I got something for you, man. I got something for you, man. Uh, let's go with EMP. And we might as well warlord it. 
See if we can get a good shot right off the bat. Yeah. Probably the sensor issues for that guy. Alright. It's interesting loadout. I like a rack too. Hey. Hey. Hey, listen. Oh, I don't know what that herby is. Doesn't matter where we go though, he's gonna be able to see us. Let's get over here. We'll just see what our best chance to hit is then. Twenty. Twenty nine. Forty four. Fifty seven. Let's give this guy some love. Ooh, nice shot. Maybe things are looking up. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Maybe not. Orders? I wonder if the vulture could have done it by itself here. The problem is movement, right? We got the weapon Contact? systems. We just don't have the movement on that thing. Let's just get this way. Acknowledged. I want to stay up on top. I have no idea where the reinforcements are coming from. They'll probably have one lance from here and another lance from somewhere else. So I don't want to be too far of where, where I need to be. Get in the open. We're going to lob this onto the urban mech, I think. Probably the best chance to hit. 4%, huh? Well, you do have gunnery 3. Oh, a couple hits. Not bad. So you got a mortar. Heads up, Commander. You've got hostile contacts. Oh, they got more guys coming. Yes, that's what I love. I love surprises like that. Turrets are coming online. Let's see what we got. I would go without the turrets. I'd be happy if it was just the... Uh, we got a blackjack over here. I'd be happy if it was just the... Uh, if it was just the two mechs. Alright, Rusty. Let's roll you back. I was not expecting them to come in from behind us, but you should probably be able to handle the entire lance over here by yourself, I think. So we'll get you over there. I'm pretty sure... I mean... With a pair of ultra fires and a pair of ER large lasers, I think that's probably more than enough for that side. It's just gonna be like pointed at a light mech delete, pointed at a light mech delete. I'm receiving you. Uh do we wanna get you supporting? What else what else do we have back here? Oh, there's more than one. Crosscut, rifleman, dervish. Oh, okay. Blackjack, commando. Looks like it's gonna be fun. I guess we better get you back over here. Affirmative. Alright, we'll split up a little bit. This is going to be intense, I think, if they decide to shoot for the base. 10%. 10% in the blackjack. It's got a, probably got a pair of um, medium rifles. That's a lot of missiles, and I don't want this guy shooting at the base, so... I don't think we're going to hit him, but... Take the shot on him, anyway. Failed to connect. You did! I'm here. I'm wondering if she could handle this side. Uh, what do I want to do here? What do I want to do? Swordsman's got the capacity for a lot of damage. But then so does that Centurion and so does this guy. This would probably be a kill shot if we hit him from behind. I'm going to be out of ammo for those quad missile pods in three turns. So let's make these three turns count. Let's take the urban mech out. And hope we get the shot here. Yep. Good night. 
Okay, then I think what we do... Ah, this Hetzer, man, I don't know. What do you need? I need you to delete stuff, but... I don't think you've got the cap capability to do that. Let's just go with Swarm. He's got a rack too, man. Yeah, shit, he goes before the Hetzer. Everyone goes before the Hetzer, probably. Oh, Hetzer goes on 10. That's not bad. Wait, we got... a handful of turrets. They may be able to help out over there. At least those guys on the other side of the base, these guys uh, over here, are down the hill. A lot of them can't see the buildings, and a lot of them don't have range for it. So that's a benef That's a huge benefit for us. Wish that Whitworth would turn around and engage the javelin. Vulture is going to go on the. Or, yeah, the vulture is going to go on the, um, either the dervish or the uh, rifleman. It's heating up fast though. Interested to see whether next. Uh, the reinforcements come at the end of this round. At least I think they do. Unless that was it. Receiving you. Okay, it's got a direct line of sight in the swordsman. Want to keep those rack twos from shooting at the buildings. We got uh, LK, right? Let's use that. Gonna get the uh, Nidhogg to delete that Centurion next. Yeah, because usually it's at the end of round seven, right? That the uh, reinforcements arrive? No, I guess that was it. I guess that, I guess that was the reinforcement wave. All right, well. Hopefully that sensors. Once that vulture gets up on the hill, we shouldn't need to move too much. Okay, we've got a sentinel helping out over here. That's nice. At least the Holopolis can't technically be out of position. We can just rotate around and just start hitting them, hitting them with RD as we move up. So that's not too bad. I'm not afraid, I'm not afraid of where his position is. Yeah, I wish that Whitworth would turn around and fight that... Uh, That guy. Once that vulture crests the hill, these guys are in trouble. So I'm just, I've been thinking like lately too that maybe I ought to start splitting the lances up for missions that we take that aren't like, you know, clans or um, uh Comstar or Word of Blake or anything like that. We just split them up so that we are only using like maximum of six six units at a time. Hey. All right. Well, I'm just thinking for difficulty's sake, right? Keeping things fresh. All right. Let's hope we get the hit. Target yep. An enemy rear. See ya. Oh, he's still alive. Barely. Heavy rifle's gone though, so he's pretty much useless. I think he's got his LRM-10 left, and that's about it. That's the Dervish. I think. Yeah, he's got the LRM- oh, he's got a pair of L oh, LRM-10? Maybe two LRM-10s? Whatever it is, I don't know. Yes, Commander. I remember the Centurion we used to use a while back. When I was very, like, first playing Battletech before Rogue Tech. I think I had like three SRM sixes and what did I have in the arm? AC ten or AC five or something like that. It was a pretty heavy brawler. Blackjack, blackjack. 
Dervish, Hunchback, okay. There's that Rifleman that's hot. Crosscut, Urban Mech, and the Commando. So, all right, we can see everybody now, right? Four, eight, yeah. So what's our best chance to hit? We got Artemis on this SRM4, I keep forgetting that. Um, we want to get the one type too though, right? Yeah. I think it's going to be the commander we're shooting at, but I just want to check people here. Definitely just taking the best chance to hit. Yeah, we'll just go after this guy. Wow. Alright. Hopefully you don't hit the wrong person and then they just take you down. That would be bad. I don't want to spend a million bucks for a mech and then just have it trashed in this first battle. So I've been noticing in the store too, depending on what where, what planet you go to, there's been a fair number of um, fair number of mechs and like and vehicles that you can get that are actually half decent. I was kind of really shocked. That guy should go down soon. Like I've even seen like parts of a Highlander in there too, right? Expensive, but I've seen them. Kind of cool. Uh, Commander? All right, who are we gonna delete? Or at least try to delete. Position confirmed. So was that mines or was that inferno ammo? Four land mines explode, okay. All right, let's go around the board here. Wow, 99% with the lasers. <laughs> it's kind of a waste of a shot in that guy though. Blackjack. God, look at the chances to hit Rifleman. I think it's because we have the, uh, that, this, the sensor that gives us better chance to hit the hotter the mech, enemy mech is. Irby. That could be a kill on the Irby. I think we're gonna go against the Rifleman. I just wanna check everybody here. Yeah, so let's go against the Rifleman. I'm gonna Warlord this too. Alright, I think this is probably the best play. Firing on target. Alright, everything but one. Not bad. Oh shit, they can see buildings now. It's a good thing the buildings have a lot of health in this one. Wait, uh, where are you? Yes, Commander. Alright, pretty good chance to hit. Take it on this guy. Nice. He decided to come out in the open for us, so that make, that helps out. Oh, is somebody a little angry? Okay, you can cut it out now. 17 from 30 hit by AMS. He might have pirate uh, launchers. I'm wondering if we should just leave that guy and go after the javelin now. Because these two guys over here are pretty crippled. Crosscut going on 21, eh? Oof. I'm here. Uh stay in the trees, please. I'm there. 10% less damage is probably going to be beneficial. Uh, is that still the best chance to, to hit? I think so, probably. Yep. Acknowledge. Well, we hit somebody. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. It's all good. So we're out to Whitworth, okay. You be my damage sponge, I don't mind. What no? What no? Can you get over there to delete the other guy? You can't really. Bad chance to hit if we do it that way. I still have to move though. Let's see if we can finish this guy off. This guy had 30 missiles, so it's probably good that we use the uh, quad pods on this guy. Okay, there we go. Enemy down. Man, that HVAC 20. All out of SRMs. Yeah, that's pretty good. 
As long as it hits. We'll get on him next turn. Where's the Whitworth going? Who's up? Standing by. Think we can delete this guy? Probably not. He's taking a lot of damage though. Ooh, see ya. Got an ammo on a ammo explosion on him. Prototype double heatsink. So hopefully he's got hopefully the kit survived. It was an ammo explosion, probably not, but you never know. So it's just the uh, one guy left on this side. Going after the panther, eh? Alright. Fair enough. Oh, somebody's taking some lerms. Hunchback J. That's the missile back, eh? Isn't it the one with the two LRM-5s? Is it two LRM-5s it's got? Waiting I think it orders. is. I think it's two LRM-5s. On my way. So the rifleman is shut down. Who had the PPC? Was it the crosscut? That's the dervish. He's partially hidden by the dervish. If we miss, we might hit the dervish too, right? Got the chance to hit. Look at this. Fucking crazy. ER PPC plus capacitor, mine dispenser 10, so that's gone. Tandem rockets. Mediocre armor. We're not going to kill all these guys, I don't think. Maybe I should just focus on... Uh, like taking these guys down. Firing. Sure, go for the leg, take the torso, whatever. I think I hit something good. Yeah. So, um, Fist of Dorn suggested me looking for hyper velocity AC5s for the arms of the rifleman. I think that's a good idea. If we can get HVAC 5s, that'd be fantastic. But I don't know, like, I haven't seen any yet, I don't think, in any of my playthroughs. It's. it's there's so many loadouts I want to go with, but there's so many loadouts I can't because I just don't have the ammo for it. Or I don't have a weapon. Ammo and no weapon, weapon and no ammo. You know? Story of my life right now. Wow, it's only 4%. Well, you are kind of a garbage pilot. Let's just burn through some standard. We'll save the LK for when we have a better chance to hit. See if we can draw some fire from the hunchback. Ooh. You've got my attention now. You've got my attention now. I don't know if you want it or not, but... Ooh, nice. Okay, sir, I'm turned. He's penned. I wonder if we save the HVAC rounds. Like, I don't bother shooting at the javelin. We leave him alone. And I just fly that Nidhogg over there and save the HVAC... Oh, man. Save the HVAC rounds for, uh... Some other mechs. Stand and buy. You gotta keep moving. Keep moving, stay in the trees. Get a couple chevrons of evasion. See if you can get the leg. Roger that. Target confirmed. Or you just shoot it on the complete opposite side of where I asked you to shoot. That's fine. Whatever works for you. Okay, still going on the Whitworth. That's good news. Wonder if the buildings are just out of range for them. Ready for orders. Okay, we're gonna walk it, I think. Actually, how far can can we get a direct line of sight? We can. Okay, we're gonna sprint it then. All right. Both I was gonna say we'd walk and get a better chance to hit, but uh, we might as well sprint it. I think it's out of range for. Oh, it's not out of range for direct fire. 
It is here, though. Not there. I gotta go with Swarm. Because it's gonna hit everybody around there. Nice hit. Somebody had some AMS. Zero hits, though. Ooh, Rifleman went down with the Swarm. Nice. It was probably a CT hit, though. It's kind of shitty, which means we get less salvage out of it, but... I don't know. I don't know. We'll see at the end of the match if we got one piece or two. Here. Little sprint sounds good. Uh-huh. Throttling up for what it's worth. Now, you've only got... What round is it? Seven? we got four shots left. Yeah, I'm not going to take that shot. I'm not going to take that shot. At 14%, if I miss and hit a building, that's just bad news. Nice. He's yours, man. I'm not going to I'm not going to touch that guy. I'm going to let the I'm going to let the turrets and the uh, our defenders take care of him. Man, is backing up. All right. What's up, boss? What's up, boss? Getting the trees. I think it's time for that dervish to uh, know that we see him. Confirmed. Nice. We see you. Still got to kill that uh, urban mech, though. I'd love to do it with the uh, HVAC 20, but we'll see how it goes. Might be able to get the Halopolis, Hel Halopolis on it as well. Halopolis. That vulture stays pretty cool. Waiting for orders. Just putter it up. Shoot that hunchback. Got the direct line of sight. Might as well just plank him. I don't know. We see him. What's up, buddy? He's jammed. Ooh, nice shooting. Alright, who's up? Who is up? Dervish. At least they're not shooting the buildings now. We're good to go. We got three rounds. This 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 round, two more. Let's go after the Irby. Forty-eight. Forty-eight in the crosscut. Forty-two in the hunchback. Forty-two. Let's see if we can get the Urban Mech this turn. Ah. No love on that strike. That's alright, it just means you're drawing less attention to yourself. You've only got like half armor in your torsos and stuff, so... Thank goodness we got at least a heavy mech up Good here. To go. Thank goodness we got a heavy mech. Location confirmed. Get that extra needed chevron of evasion. Gonna go after the urban mech. It's more lord in a bit. Little bit. Let's fire at him. Still haven't jammed those ultras yet. It's pretty good. When you got gunnery ten, though, I think the recoil is like minus three or something. So, the chance for jam drops significantly. Pulse lasers, eh? Pulse lasers, eh? Commander. Or just a lot of lasers. Let's get over here. Position confirmed. We can see this guy directly, so let's go after him. And I'm gonna go with EMP on him because I don't want him to be shooting back. Okay, nice. 
Or at least if he does decide to shoot back, that he's uh, going to have a hard time seeing us. Yeah, I think they've really done a great job. Like, the more I think about the, like, the chance to hit and the stealth systems now and ECM and what they've done with everything, it's the, the mod, for me anyway, is starting to feel really balanced. Like everything is feeling really balanced. There's no more of those, like, just like, you know, uh, ER large laser builds or, or um, large improved heavy laser builds where you can put four of them on a mech or any of that stuff because you just can't sink the heat anymore. So hey. you really got to get get the most use out of everything that you've got. I, I, I'm just really, really enjoying I'll that. Try. Yeah, I'm really enjoying it, I gotta say. 51%, that's where the shot's going. Ooh, another hit. Another hit like that, and you're toast. To Alright, we'll go for a direct line of sight on this guy, and we'll fire. Uh, let's switch to LK. Marginally better chance to hit. You back up. Shooting at the Hetzer. Good luck with all that EMP on you. The loss of sensors is like... It's huge. Especially, well, if you can't see your target and then you get major sensor deprivation. Ooh, 25 damage to the leg, really? And you get major sen sensor deprivation. It's just like good luck hitting your enemy. Nice. Beautiful. We got two more turns after this one to clean up what's left. I want to see if we can get the urban mech. And then. I don't think anything else has got gear that we want. Maybe. I'm taking internal damage. Maybe. Maybe pulse lasers from this guy? Good to go. Where is your internal damage? Oh, someone's using tandem. Fucking bastards. Get over Moving here. To position. I'm gonna let my other guys handle the urban mech, but we're gonna go after this guy here. Uh I think we just shoot him. All right, not bad. Well, there goes the arm. Critical hit, Commander. They're pirate pulse lasers, though, so they got a misfire chance and everything. You guys know how I feel about the misfire chance. I'm just not. The last thing you want to do is have your weapon uh, malfunction, or or jam. On those turns that you absolutely need it, you know. So I don't mind like that the slow and steady buildup of uh, Got it. of weapons. It's like yeah, if I'm missing a little bit here or there, that's fine. As long as I'm not jamming, as long as I can keep shooting, I'm happy. You know. Oh, he's got pepper box rifles. That's what he's got. So I don't really care about him then. Dervish. We can probably get a kill on the dervish this turn. I'm gonna go with incendiary. Copy that. Well, not if we don't hit him in the right spots, we're not. They're shooting at me. I mean, I guess we could find components I'm here. to minimize the, uh, like, really minimize the uh, jam chance and stuff. Get into there. Confirmed. Let's fire at this guy. I don't know. It's like it's really iffy. Like I don't. I, you can take a targeting computer that's going to lower your jam chance, but then I mean, I guess if you're like have a double rack build, that would be perfect, right? 
But then you'd almost want to like consider. I mean, uh, that's if you've got a really, really good pilot. No. You'd almost want to consider like not going that route and just going with. Um, let's get right into here. You know, going with accuracy and front loading your damage so you're hitting more often. And then by the time you're jammed, it won't matter because they're dead anyway. Here we go. Ah, you missed. We got eyes and sensors on all these guys now, so it should make it easier for us to hit. At least that wasn't on me. Oh wait, I think this guy's got two LRM-10s. The, uh, Hunchback. Alright, what do we got, Fox? What's up, Maybe you'll be able to get your gunnery to four after this. Wouldn't that be great? Anyway, we can see that Irby. Nothing directly, eh? Alright, well, let's just shoot it from here then. 20%? Well, we're not going to do much. Let's go after this guy then. Let's go after the Dervish. I think if the Irby had an or open torso, I'd probably go for it, but... I'm out of long-range missiles. It doesn't, so I'm not gonna bother. Pepper box rifle! Wow, nothing, huh? Oh, you, why would you put smoke down there now? Okay. Looks like that was a streak too. Who's up? Commando. Commando V Panther. Oof. Barely hit, Commander. Yeah, I like the idea. Like when I was running in, the, in their in uh, regular battle tech. The Panthers aren't, aren't aren't bad if you can get like a, I think I was running with a large laser, and an LRM ten, and using them as long range strike units, and in the lighter weight classes that wasn't too bad. It's working out okay. Because you've only got two hard points I think on the Panther, one laser, one missile, so it's really hard to. Um, Figure out what you're gonna do. Hey. hey, listen. Who's this guy? Irby. Cross cut. Should I gotta go farther than that, eh? Twenty six. Really? Seventy. The cross cut might have some stuff we could use, though. Hmm. It's the last round. I gotta figure out what we're gonna get for salvage here. All right. What? No. Try and get the pirate blackjack and the dervish. Really? Looking Ooh, nice shot. Didn't expect that. You could have got. You could have killed the. Uh, you could have easily killed the uh, blackjack. Just let going after somebody else, eh? I'm probably gonna reserve everybody back past the headser. The headser is gonna go after the blackjack and see what we get I'm there. Minor damage. I'm receiving you. 
Let's reserve. We'll let the Hetzer go first against the Blackjack. See what we get. Okay, reserve. Roger that. We should be able to get the Dervish, I think. It's pretty damaged. Got it. Turd B. Pepper box rifle. Aye, aye. Oh shit, did I reserve Fox? Did I reserve her? Oh shit, you know what? I reserved her at the same time as Flatline. Stand well, fuck by. me. Shit, they both went on 10. That was what it was. Oh well. Fuck me. Just die. I'm ready for orders. It's got prototype double heat sinks and I'm blowing them all up. You gotta move if we're gonna get that dervish. Get in the open. Slightly better chance to hit. I'm on fire, but I don't really care. One of the ultras is jammed now, of course. Copy that. Yeah, no one's hit. bailing out. We, w you know, we won the mission, but I don't really feel like we won the mission because we didn't kill over half their guys. Waiting for orders. Dervish, please. Received. See what we get. See what we get. Let's go with incendiary, I guess. For some crits, nope. Inflicted some heavy damage. I guess maybe I should have gone with swarm. I don't know. Come on, bailout, Jack. Nice. Commander. That's a huge bonus for us. Got it. Okay, last shot. Let's see what we get off the dervish. Standard ammo. Here it comes. Nice try. Take. Oh, he ejected. We did get half of their guys. They had, what, two, three, four, five left? Five left? Yeah, they had five left. We got over half their guys. Wow, I should, you know what? I, I should learn not to say anything. Mission successful. All right, well, 232,000. Not bad. Not bad for that group. Okay, so, ATM-6 Pirate. I want to see the blood sport, melee accuracy and initiative, prototype double heat sinks, radical prototype double heat sink kit, standard fusion cores. That's like three hundred thousand for me right there. If I take that, we need C bills too because I'm like short on my financial report again. Big surprise. Uh, MRM improved ammo half. SRM okay. No, thank you. No, thank you. If we get the MRM improved, great. If we don't, we don't. Lower melee. Yeah, we're not building a melee mech in this particular playthrough. We're saving that for um, the hooligans. Um, I got some plans for them, by the way. Uh, what do we got here? ATM-6 Pirate. Yeah, it's just not enough launchers for me. Two parts of a rifleman. It's a 50-tonner, though. Just a little light, I think. Uh, claws. Man, I'm telling you. 275 core. Uh, okay, you know what? I'm going to take money. We're going we're gonna to go with the three engine cores here. We can make some money off them. These are like 800,000 each. So that's... It's like... Yeah, it's like 100,000 a pop, I think. So it's 300,000 right there. That's our financial report. And we're okay. All right, going to go that route. And oh, we got we got more here, right? Yeah. 275 core, I guess. 
which we can probably just sell. And whatever parts up there we get, we get. I don't really care. Or we go with the half ton of improved ammo. Nah, I think this is probably it. We'll just go this route. Let's not waffle. Okay, blackjack parts, centurion part, two dervish parts, two javelin parts, two rifleman parts, urban mech, agri laser, which is the old one that can go, armor can go, 240 core, I think we've got, yeah, we've got two of those. We don't have a 275, so let's hold on to that. Can get rid of the standard fire control systems. Those can go, jump jets can go. Uh... Let's hold on to that. I don't know. We might we might do melee. I don't know. We'll see. All right. So that's not bad. We made some good coin out that was like six hundred thousand. All right. There it is. Let's have a quick look in the um, mech bay here. So yeah, this guy just needs to get repaired. So not bad. I don't think there was anything that we can put together. Uh, we got so much to do. I gotta get so much more sea bills. Uh, I just gotta find like low level clan missions to take and just go in a wreck, wreck face and get a whole bunch of shit. I mean, I guess I could put together these, like a lot of these like lower cl clan mechs. We got two storm crows. We got a hunchback 2C. We got a Nova down here. Like the old rifleman parts can just go. You know, we got a full clint we can put together. I gotta just start getting rid of some of this stuff out of my storage because it's like all these like lo like lighter mechs can just go. I think. Um. Yeah, I'll probably just start deleting everything up to a certain. Like I've been holding on to these in case we pick up an extra part here or there. We can assemble a mech and hopefully get some clan gear. So I mean, that's like there's a good reason to do that. But these inner sphere mechs. For the most part, unless there's something special, I've just been ditching them because, like, what's the point, right? Like, the Raptor might give us some good electronics, so I've been holding on to that. But, uh, other than that, there's, like, no point. Well, so we've got two points of, two parts of a Centurion now. I guess we'll hold on to that. Two parts of a Hunchback, two parts of a Wolverine. We're close with a few of them. I mean, the Dervish parts, it's the... Well, it's just a regular dervish, but yeah, it's just trash that. It's a hundred thousand we can make right there. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm going to end this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Till next time, we'll see y'all later.